guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. If you haven't already, click that button for daily and consistent content. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. If you haven't already, click that button for daily and consistent content. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. If you haven't already, click that button for daily and consistent content. Head for daily and consistent. Daily and consistent. For daily and consistent. Content. For daily and consistent. Content. For daily and consistent content. Head. 3,000 flipping subscribers. Oh my God. I can't believe it. I just want to say thank you to everyone who has taken the time just to watch my videos. I don't even know why you guys want to watch me. Like It's absolutely mad. When I first started YouTube, I was thinking, why would someone want to watch me? Why would someone want to watch me? I thought I was an idiot starting it. And now I've got 3,000 supporters. Which this is only the beginning. Let me tell you this now. This is only the beginning. I'm going to continue it throughout my whole journey. <gasps> You're the last one. Have you subscribed? Yep. Okay. Good. Let me refresh the page. Just yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Are you dumb? Are you actually dumb? Are you actually dumb? 100,007! Oh my god! Oh my! Oh my god, guys! Oh my god! <laughs> For once in my life, in my YouTube life, I'm actually speechless because I'm always talking, but I'm here. I have arrived. We have arrived, guys. 100,000 fucking subscribers. For YouTubers to reach this milestone is a lot, but for me, it's especially a lot for multiple different reasons. When I tell you, nobody believed in me, man. Nobody, not one soul on this planet believed in me or thought that I could do it. Not one person, nobody thought that I could achieve any form of success when it comes to YouTube. No one. Not one being. I remember I used to come home to like interventions and I used to be told, you know, just delete the channel. At this point I had like 2000 something, it was something quite fresh delete it or something that, you know, you don't need to do, or it doesn't make any sense, or you know, you probably won't do become anything with it or it's just a waste of your time it looks silly it looks dumb or something like nobody really saw it in me other than myself i'm actually so speechless like i don't know how to even do this video i don't know how to formulate everything i just saw a room i had a camera and i just had an idea and here i am with over a hundred thousand of you guys who have seen something in me when I didn't see it in myself and when everyone around me definitely did not see it in me. I had a vision in my head and I just followed it. From the back chat London reviews to talking about very important issues from colorism and racism from the beginning of this channel that I've done. Content, inject it, I used to say it all the time, inject it, inject it, inject it. And when no one around you people that are meant to, but when nobody believes in you as a person, as an individual, but you yourself in here know that it's something that you want to do and you have the passion for it. Don't listen to anybody and go for it. I am living proof that that can work. Go for it, regardless of whatever anybody is saying. And although it sounds impossible, although you can't see the other side of that ridiculous high mountain, Believe me, when you get to that particular top of that mountain and you can see the other side, it is a whole different world, guys. Now, regardless of how many people are trying to pull you down or don't believe in you or don't really want to support you or don't really care about it, they, don't, they look at you differently, they're not really interested, they think that it's going to be this, this, that, just put your head down and focus and let your work do the talking. Man, I nearly ended my life. <sighs> Three years ago. <sighs> e
even when it seems impossible, even when the, just the going got tough for so many multiple external reasons of just trials and tribulations that I've gone through in my life that I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have gone through as well. We've all had difficult lives in some manner and aspects, some more than others. But you persevere. You persevere. Do you understand? You persevere. You fight through. You stand tall, not in just for yourself, but just for justice. You stand tall against the bullies, against the bad people in your life, and you just continue to shine and let your work do the talking. Not just me. Yes, I put in the work day in, day out, 5 a.m., 6 a.m., sometimes up till 7 a.m. in the morning, getting videos out and scheduling them and working my head off. But also to you guys who took the time to want to watch me and subscribe, it means a lot more than you'd know. It's crazy when you just stop for a minute. You stop for a minute and you just look back at everything and you're just like... It felt like it went for a very long time, but at the same time, it also felt like it was a blip, you know? Yeah, i just like to thank you all from the bottom of my heart and just I'd really like to thank you all for taking the time to watch my videos, to subscribe, to enjoy the laughter, the reactions and Here's to the next 100k guys. Here's to the next 100k. Thank you so much. I love you all. I tr I do with my heart and here are some of my best moments. I'm talking like I've just been evicted from a show child and someone's interviewing me and saying that I've got best moments. But anyways, I compiled just a few because you damn well know I'm not going through every one of those damn videos that I've been putting out every single day. So I've just gone through, you know, most of them here and there, having the time to quickly edit and put out something for you guys to enjoy. Thank you very much. And I will catch you guys soon for daily and consistent content. But I don't know about you, but I am sick and tired of the unnecessary shade that Tamar be throwing at Jeannie for no damn reason. It's anti-blackness throughout all the cultures that I have been brought up in and I thought today would be the day that I would simply just talk about it. Kenya Moore is running this reunion and checking everyone. Let me tell you why I'm pissed. Because this has been going on for too long and for those people who are saying racism is no longer present, you have lied to yourself. Someone has lied to you. So congratulations, you tried it. The 21st century, 2016, to be just as racist as people many, many moons ago. Nothing has changed. Nothing has developed. Nothing has improved. It is diabolical. Another innocent person killed, slaughtered, absolutely desiccated for no valid reason apart from the fact that of his colour of his skin. And because his colour of his skin is black, therefore this implies he is dangerous, he's a robber, he's a big bad dude, as this guy was described. And the way that guy was looking at him when he was on his helicopter, that police guy, he said, oh, he's definitely a big bad dude. Because of his skin, you have implied that, and therefore this has caused jurisdictions on the Terence Crutcher's family, who are now suffering through pain, and he also was a father, so the children are crying probably their eyes out as well. They need demeaned, undermined, bullied, taken down for no reason, simply because of their colour. Their cut people have allowed them to be placed in a box where just because of their colour, they're seen as rude and obnoxious people as opposed to brown women or as opposed to white women and hey me, I need someone to tell me to shut up. Excuse me? Right and da 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 I need a man that's gonna be like, Esther, shut up. Alright, babe. Are you okay? See, I don't understand. Some people get more stupid and stupid as the show gets along. Why would you want somebody to tame you? Are you an animal? Are you a pig? Are you a horse? I don't think you are, Hester. Like, what? what is going on between Nikita and Terrell? What the hell is going on? Wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. 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 Oh, love is your Hmm? I am. Yeah, mama. Oh, love is your Why are you mm -hmm. caressing my mom's bum? The way you just. to your own mother. I'm down with. I'm down with him. I, I'm. I can't. <laughs> Es
the instrument. Let's talk about how Muslim women who wear headscarves suffer economically more than anybody else in society today. Let's talk about how 43% of Muslim women do not report hate crimes to the police because of lack of confidence and fear. Alright, oh! brother. What? I knew it. I knew it. What a waste, man! What a waste, man! What a waste, man! What a waste, man! Him and is that a thing or what? Yolande? <laughs> Yolande? <laughs> the god that I'm serving today, we are not going to allow Danny and Arabella to win. They will not be winning this season, they will not be winning the season next year, they will not be winning the season the year afterwards. It's not going to occur, not in this lifetime today. Hey! What goes around comes around. You want me to send it? You want me babes? You want to know you're my boyfriend, Mr. Fucking Boyfriend, fucking fake dickhead. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I'm not hitting on her. I'm just like, yes, I be. Yes, I be. What kind of guy? You just said it. Fucking like. Just hit more now. Where the dog? Why else would he have pulled you to the side? You don't say that. You are talking to your girlfriend. No wonder you've had one relationship and you fucked about hundred girls. Sugar honey iced tea. She's shaking, but she doesn't. She doesn't sweat. Let's go. They thought that they, this could happen. That you want to tell me that they have a week left, and this is what they're doing. We're looking for the final, and this is what they're doing. Yeah, I'll be your damn mind. It's going down, just damn show you, man. I told him to inject it. And I'm in the dad house as well. Gregory, why are you lying? Gregory, why are you lying? Gregory, why are you lying? Gregory, did you cheat on Amber with a girl who's 20 years old? <laughs> you hate to see it. At a place called Electric Picnic. Electric Picnic. Sounds like a place where you go to die. You hate to see it. Gregory, when are you returning that 25k? Or have you already spent it on the dead crop tops? You hate to see it. Gregory, I thought you weren't in it for the fame game. So why are we promoting your dead radio show? We damn well know nobody is tuning into that. You hate to see it. Gregory, why are you a waste man? Why? You hate to see it. Gregory, are you really 24? No, I'm joking, I'm joking. You've been confused, Antelope. What the hell are you talking about, you clown? It is ever. She has not been clear from day one. <laughs> now, this group are really violent because this is this this cannot run. Okay. 
so we can see it changing now as well let's end the performance anyways i'm done with this entire group i'm um, hopefully they have been voted off if they have been if they haven't i really don't know like i don't watch a show like that i'm pretty sure no one does when it comes to this group when it comes to the show you need to just really exit the stage you jumped off the stage clearly but unfortunately you jumped back on you one day babes you one day babes 72 hours and you're making friends for life friends where friends who talking absolute nonsense miss shoelace miss shiba sheree miss she i'm just so over <sighs> Ted won't leave. He's like, who's gonna stop me, fam? I'm wild. I'm not going anywhere, fam. Alone, yeah, that's we that killed me, fam. That's deep down in your heart of hearts. The <laughs> special guest is on the park. I knew it. I knew it. What is it? I knew it. It was just me. Even on Valentine's Day, she left off. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Oh shit. What? Oh shit. What? What? Hey, you know what? Fuck this show, you know. This season's been dead. It's a write off. No, I'm done. Forget it. Hey, goods. I'm out. I'm dead. This is a mess. The mother is chasing her as well. I don't. And so much has happened. You know what? I can't do this video right now. Okay, to run off to Canada. What the hell am I doing? I've got to fly in two hours. <clears throat> oh, that is much better. Safe and sound in Toronto. Negativity cannot rise. We have to close the doors. So the negativity is locked out. It's double locked. The door is closed. This negativity will not rise. Not today, please. It will not rise. Listen, fuck you white racists, do you understand? Fuck you all. With my chest, fuck you all. I don't swear on this channel. I never have sworn. I keep it very, you know, I'm very well spoken. But with my chest, fuck all of you dumb why racist? Fuck you all, you fucking cunts. Listen, I said it with my chest. Woo! Listen, I'm gonna hype now, but fuck you all. Do you understand? Fuck you all with every fiber in my body. The fact that you think it's okay for you to just take somebody's life because you feel like you want to do it because you have this weird power trip with this racist mindset is disgusting. So we have this waste man, bottom barrel scum, dickhead, who is getting dragged left, right, and center, and rightly damn so, because you are nothing but an elite waste man. You are nothing but an elite lamppost. Hey, Tamara Morali. I'm here with Danny and Consistent Content.